You know, this was produced by a company, Atari, which I believe is no longer in business. Um, so, I don't know if you would call this official or not. Um, as for whether people use uh, various websites, I think people still do. Although I've I've tried playing on there, and um, I'm not especially good compared to those people. And I understand those people are just hobbyists anyhow. So um, yeah, I think I'm gonna just play some Scrabble mini games. Um, oh, let me pick a name. Alrighty, let's go with our favorite username. And let's just see what we can learn here. I used to really enjoy this, and then my computer couldn't play this anymore. And it's been a while, so... Um, yeah, let's try this stuff. Find the best place to put the room. Okay, I didn't ask for all the sound here, but that's cool. Find the best place to put the word bub. Well, I'm thinking here. Yeah. Oh, and then I type on the keyboard, right? Okay. Uh, jute. Where would I put jute on here? Um, hmm. I'm not sure. Oh, this looks like a good place. Let's try that. Okay. C. This is a good fun little game mode, because I don't have to worry about finding the anagram here. Um, I just have to find the place to play the word. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Um. Yeah, I'm not sure where I put that word. C. Um. At least I assume it's in the right order. Maybe it's not. Maybe I've been tricked. Maybe I just play here, right? C, this would be 3, 4, 5, 6 times 2 is 12. It says that my top or max possible score for this move would be 22. Um, so right now that's what I'm looking at. It's just C's down here. Um, I guess V might be cool. Like, what if I put it here? Current score is 17. I'm not upset about that. I'd be pretty happy with that in a real game. That's where my level of skill is right now. Um, is there somewhere better to put it? Um... Uh, unless there's some word that I don't know. Um, this is probably the best I can score. Or, rather, because there's probably some word I don't know, I can't score any better. Um, interesting. Let's play it. Game over. Let's press reset to play again. Okay. Huh. Apparently I have to score the top score every time or it doesn't doesn't give me credit. That's weird. Uh, we're gonna try this. I don't know if ATI is a word, but it scores the right number of points, so apparently it is. Max scores 31 for this play. That's not 31. Um, 
Hmm. So where could I put this? Yeah, I wish I could just run it straight down there. That would be amazing. Uh, wait, just put down one letter? Oh, that's just 25, though. I need to score 31 here. Give me a hint. Move place four times. On row 10. Okay. Give me another hint, because I... 10 across from, or from 10E. No, that's what I originally put down. It said max score... Oh, I put it in the wrong column. The J needs to be atop the triple letter score. Okay, I get it. So, assuming that that's the word... Um... Yeah, we're going to go back to the minigame menu, because that's suddenly becoming difficult. Let's try just anagrams. Oh! Find all the words on the rack. Alrighty. I can try this. Um, Alright, I don't know why I need to use the mouse to do this. That seems kind of clunky and silly. Yeah, now the fact that I have to use the mouse... To, oh, never mind. I can do this with the keyboard, too. Alright, so now I'm stumped. No. I'm getting closer to being stumped. Um... Alright, so there's ten words remaining, um, and I don't think I know them all. Zen is not a word. Okay, how about the Linux kernel Zen? Is this based off of... That's also not a word. Um, hmm. Alright. Oh, come on. Okay, well... I don't know. What are the remaining? Okay. We're gonna go back to the minigame menu. And pick a different game. Um, so, let's try bingo. Of course it gives me two blanks. Maybe that makes it easier. Um, uh, wow. So I see zip. I see an N and an L on an open column. So my initial thought was like zip lining, um, but it doesn't quite work. Yeah. Yeah. IZR is it? Oh, yeah, yeah. I see what you're saying, that I could just go to a website and do all the anagrams uh, with that. I don't know. This is... I think this is an interesting exercise, although I'm not sure um, what the word is. I see that there's an open R on the bottom rank. Um, I forget, I think Scrabble uses coordinate notation that differs from chess. Um, I could be entirely wrong on that. No, no, it is rank, so that would be rank 15, um, starting at H15, I guess. Unzipping. That's cool. Um, so, yeah, 
zipping, unzipping, and so forth are all English words that use those letters. Um, so, uh, what else? I don't know, I should just try to find a way to play zipping somewhere. Obviously the top part of the board is really challenging unless I find a way to play starting at uh, 1H or H1. Um, I want to like say spin something with a Z. Uh, I'm not seeing it though. So, what can I do here? Huh. You know, I'm not sure. I'm going to take a hint, because I'm not sure what it is. First letter is P. Okay. I'm um, awful, so I'm going to take another hint. The word is puzzling. Okay, but what's the word? No, okay, I'm just kidding. Kidding. Alright, so, yeah. Uh, I assume that's the place to put it. Play. Okay, cool. Yeah. So I kind of sort of cheated on that last one. Um... Here, I'll give you this one while I start to prepare my food. Okay, my food is starting cooking, and let's see, what have we got here? There's a lot of possibilities, except for the fact that there's an F and a P here. Um, so, you know, I've, I don't know, I've, I've got, I see the word flips, um, I see the word fails, I see the word pales, 
Um, I see P. Laffy. Um, P. Laffy's. As in, like, rice P. Laffy? All right. Now, where would I put that if that were the word? We have a max score of 76 on this, so we know it's not a bingo on the triple letter score. Um, but I have the strangest feeling that I've gotten it wrong, so let's... F. F is the first letter. Okay. I still don't know what it is. What could it possibly be that starts with an F? Um, uh, shuffle. Huh. It's probably using the M somehow. Films? Flips? Flimsy? I don't know. Fl <laughs> Flea pits. Of course. What else could it possibly be? All right. So where would I put flea pits? Um, I guess it's going to go here, right? F-L-E-A pits. Yeah, perfect. Play. All righty. Elm Tran. All right. Mantle. Mantler? Mantler's probably not good. Um, I'll try to keep them put. Hmm. One second while I go clear something up there. I don't know. Um, something weird happened on my computer here. Um, So, what could it be here? I saw mantle. Helmet? Um, what else could it possibly be? I don't know. I'm taking a hint. First letter is T. That really doesn't narrow it down, although it does let me know that I'm either building... No, I'm not into building down the middle. So, yeah. T is definitely this T. Um, but it might be through another letter that's on the board. Hmm. I'm going to guess that it uh, probably ends in something like ER. Um, laminator? No. No, so it starts with a T. That's what we figured out so far. I'm still not seeing it. Um... And yeah, I, I think most Scrabble players understand that while scoring bingos is, uh, it scores a lot of points, that's not where decisive games are decided. Um, um, 
a lot of word knowledge, especially in twos and threes, goes a long way. And I have only scratched the surface of that. Um, but certainly this is a fun exercise. Uh, I'm trying to think of what else could be. Terminal. Yeah, combine with this over here. Terminal. Uh, yeah, so I see where I can put it. Seventy-eight points. Very good. Well spotted. All right. Should I? Maybe I should play a real game. Uh, these. Mini games are fun, but they're not doing much to help my knowledge. I know there are lists of twos and threes. Um, just to show you, like, what I'm going up against when I play this, I'm going to just play a few here. All this game does is test what your uh, word knowledge is. Um, I do kind of wish that little noise there. Oh, wow, I've got eight letters down there. K-I is not a word, K-A is a word, N-A is a word, N is a word, um, N is a I already played N. M is a word, M is a word, Ma is a word, Me. Okay. Um, so I got key, which was wrong. Uh, so far I've gotten so far. What have I missed? AA is a word. AE. Um, <laughs> after this I'll actually switch to a real game. Um. But no, I got 14 of 17, so you could say I'm a beginner Scrabble player. I certainly don't frequent tournament scenes. Um, I have a little bit above typical beginner's word knowledge, but um, I'm still definitely in the beginner class. So I'm just trying to see if I remember anything else here. I don't think I do. Um, I have X on here already? Yes, I do. I have X, M, Ma. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna um, give up at this point and have it show me. AI. I was thinking about AI. I've seen any played before. Um, oh, and me. Am I? Wow. It's really a pity I missed that one. All right, so let's play a game. Uh, main menu. You can even play a network game if anybody's got the old Atari CD for this. <laughs> I don't think that's happening. All right. Yep, 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 that's all good. Player options. Yeah, pick some tiles for me. Don't make me go pick them. Common word hints. Okay, sure. Uh, yeah, computer player. Novice. All right. Hopefully I don't lose too badly to novice. Uh, I could even show its tiles if I'm feeling terrible about it, but... Here we are, playing a nice, casual game. Uh, so I see Finger, Fringe. Um, I'm not sure which is better to start with, if I'm aiming for an exciting game. Or I could just hold on to the blank and play... I've got one vowel. Yeah, it's not good for me. I could even play Gur. Although I don't know if this has Gur in its dictionary. But I could play it. Um, 
Um, mm -hmm. so yeah, finger and fringe both use the same letters. I probably, I do like having an R. It'd be nice to have an A or an E because I'm more comfortable with those kinds of words. Uh, I could also play fig and hope for good letters. Uh, it does use up more consonants than vowels. And it would get rid of um, my F. I could also play fur, which would get rid of my double letter. Although the double letter is an R, which isn't so bad. Yeah, I could play in. In's a word. You know, I don't even know. Could I just play I? It's the letter I. I mean, it's a word, but um, it's also a proper noun. But in a way, it isn't. It's, yeah. I think fur is probably good, as is fig. And although R and G go well together, so yeah, maybe fur is the way to go. Um, we're gonna try that. Twelve points, leaving behind N, G, and R. I'll try it. Toyer. Okay. <laughs> Appear to be outclassed here. Is tonger a word? T O N G U E R? I mean, yeah, the reason I played my first plays I did is so I would have a very bingo friendly hand here. Um, so. Let's see. Entourage. It's totally not how you spell it. Um, no, there's got to be some way to score a lot of points here. Frontage? F R O N T A G A? A G E? Somebody let me know if this is a word. Um, I have no idea. Griffin. Ah, let's go back. Wait, how is... Oh, you're talking about my first play. Oh my goodness, I did not see Griffin. That's really good. Um, yeah, that would have been a fantastic way to start. I'm thinking frontage is a word. Um... Well, I I fear for stream delay that um, some people might be delayed here. Um, and uh, uh, so I'm just gonna give this a try. Yeah. And of course I put the E right next, like, right in between two triple word scores like an idiot. Um, but fortunately my opponent didn't take advantage of that, so... Um, that's fun. Um, so, what do I do here? I've got a lot of vowels, and not a lot of knowledge of words that only have vowels. Um, so where would I even... I want to play it here. I mean, the best I see is just Fee, F-E-E. -E. Um, or Fi, F-I-E. But I want to play more letters than that. There's like FOIA or however you spell that. I don't remember that, but um, or maybe I'm thinking FO F A U X. Yeah, it's probably what I'm thinking of. Um, 
uh, I'm just going to play Fee. Because I don't see anything better. Feast. Okay, up here. Yeah, that actually sounds a lot better. Uh, this does give me a hand which is questionable, but um, now if he scores on the triple, I can score on the other triple. So fair is fair. Um, I wonder, is WHOS a word? Like without an E at the end? Probably not. Um, uh, what do I play? Do I play like we down here? W H E E. Um, that looks pretty good. Looks starting there. Um, surely there's other possibilities here. I don't like having the duplicate eyes in my rack, but I don't think there's much I can do about that. Um, yeah, we're just going to play Wii, I suppose. No, I don't like that at all, because that leaves me with four balls. Um, like, even whoa would be, or ew, even this would be more acceptable because I at least have a consonant remaining in some hope of getting rid of the rest of these. Um, but that's not what I want to do either. Like, I could do a uh, hose down here. This leaves me with a better chance of getting rid of some of those. Um, not sure what else I could try. It's probably respectable. Um, huh. If I knew more three-letter words, this would open up my options a bit. Yep. Way to take the spot. Yeah. I guess that's why it was a blunder, because by taking this spot, it left hit my opponent wide open to take the bottom. And my opponent did not capitalize on that at all. Um, uh, so maybe I need to play against somebody that isn't novice. But still, it's probably a good warm-up. I haven't played this game in about a year, so... Uh, I'm not doing too badly, all things considered. See, I want to place my X somewhere to score tons of points. Um, like I see fix down here. I see axe, but then I need to build a cross also. And that's not happening. Um, fix isn't bad, but I just feel bad about like placing words that cloud the board and make it difficult to play later. Um, yeah, we're going to play fix though. It scores a lot of points and gets rid of the I and the X. Acid. Ooh, that's cool. I could spell dead in. play my J somewhere. Like here, here's a place to play a J. Um, it's too bad I can't score multiple, can't score the triple twice. Um, just because I don't have the right letters for it. Like jail would be fantastic. I do not have an A, however. Um, and I don't know, like, if J... I don't think J-I is a word, or J-E. But yeah, just placing the J there, and, like, I can even spell join or something. Um, 
or we could put the W here, W something something L. Uh, probably doesn't work, just because, again, I'm missing an A. Still, this is, like, too obvious to not play. I'm sure, I could play join, but I like the I and the N. Those are good letters. I could use them later. Uh, 25 points. Ken. Alright, so here's where we're playing. It doesn't really matter what the word is. Although the better the word, the more points. Uh, I could even score a walk up here. Um, but surely going through the triple scores more than anything else. Um, let's see, what else? Oh, here we go. Am I missing anything? That's probably good. Dimno. D I M E K N O W. No, no is pretty good. You gotta be pretty happy with that. Oils. I mean, if I had an F, I'm just saying. If I had a B, uh, or if I had a P, I could do spoils. Truly, my opponent is asking for it by playing such silly words. Um, but anyway, it's kind of hard to block the corner, isn't it? Why don't I just build elsewhere? What are the odds of drawing a P? So a blank's been taken. I think there's like two or three P's in the bag, and one's already been played. Um... What else could I try? Yeah, we could do this, mate. Uh, if I had an N instead of an I, that would be maidens. I don't even know if WA is a word, though. So I have to think more about that. Food is definitely ready. Let's see, what can I do? I could spell mean, M-E-A-N, right there. Um, I could spell fixed. Where else could I put something? Here we go, I could spell jail like I planned to last time. Um, let's play it. Fifteen points. <laughs> and now it spells mean. That's pretty mean. I could spell mean right back at it. Oh, if I had the right letters, this could be applaud instead of just laud. How great would that be? Um, if I had an N, I could extend no into known. But when you get to higher levels in Scrabble play, that knowing um, hooks on the beginning and the end are pretty important. Um, but once you really get somewhere is the, when that starts to matter. Um, what else can I add to this? Wait. Wait a second. Do I not have a bingo in the rack? Uh, Mr. M-I-S-T-E-R 
D. Um, immersed. See, if I had... The, the challenge with finding a bingo here is that the M and the D are um, not one-point letters. But when you have a lot of one-point letters, your odds of getting a bingo greatly increased. Also, I could consider combining with the H or the O up here to try to get a bingo. Probably the H, if anything. Um, although, having an H at the beginning of the word? I don't know. could also try to build a bingo down here. Although, I'd have to start with an E. Or I could start it there, but I'd have to start with an M. In any event, it looks like bingo is most unlikely, unless there's something straight through the A-N, some nine-letter word. I really doubt it. Um, it would be amazing if there were. How fantastic would that be? All right, so. Um, let me just pick something. Yeah, we're going to go back to what I, I was originally thinking, which is just merit. Score some points, get some letters down. Gives me some letters that I'm not exactly looking for. Um, I think the game's laughing at me somehow. Um... So we got a W and a V. That'll work. Since I'm so far ahead this game, it's not even a contest. Um, uh, we're going to just play a little bit faster and then pick a different opponent next time. Uh, honored. Um, this definitely might be out there. H-O-N-O-U-R-E-D, but there's no room on the board for it. Like, I'd have to start it there. Um, that doesn't work. Um, there's a lot of potential with this hand. Hour? H-O-U-R? I want to just build something down here. Like the word here. Or home. Um, yeah, there we go. 21 points. Alright, Rob's. No, he plays something across. Um, Is that what I want to do? I thought dower. Does that sound good? Sure. We're going to play dower. Okay. Can I spell acrobat? A C R O B E T. Nope. Alright, guys, this one's on you. Find the bingo, because I'm not feeling it right now. I'm going to get some food. Um, be back in one second here. There's definitely a bingo with a blank six one point or five one point letters and a B and then a bajillion places to start putting things. There's got to be at least something. Either starting up here um, or going down the column or heck, even through this if you find a way to do it. But there's got to be a bingo here. No question. Might take a while to find it, but I would be stunned if there just wasn't. Probate. Okay, now where do we place probate? Um, probator? Reprobate? <laughs> uh, it doesn't work that way. Operate? Uh, wait, do I have enough thrillers for operator? O-P-E-R-A-T... No, I need to use the B. Um, hmm. 
Yeah, maybe probate her. Well, that's the working theory. I'm gonna go grab my food. Alright, so, yes, the blank tile is a wild. It's a blank. Um, so you can use, it, you can play it as any letter. So our working theory is that um, this is the word to play. Let me know if you'd like to try a different word, or if we should go with it. Sorry for eating on stream, but I haven't eaten in quite some time, and I need to eat. Alright, yeah, let's go for it. mean. Hmm. Alright, what do we want to try now? I'm thinking BL something. Or maybe use the B in the top row. So we're going to go with bloated, or maybe bloaters? Probably bloated. I'm not feeling so good about bloaters. Alright, so I'm thinking bloated. After the game, we can go back and see, like, if we really missed it. Hoarders. But we have a B. Um, unfortunately, we have a B, so that's not going to work. Maybe, like, Habitors. Um... 
Do we even have the letters for habit? Um, wait, how did I come up with that? Yeah, I think I'm bloated. Um, and again, we can crit we look at the game afterward. I think this game offers the ability to do that. Hmm. Well, I see Ravage, but I don't know where to put it. Also, I want to play the V as soon as possible, but I don't see any way to conveniently play the V. Um, so it's kind of a dilemma here. Oh, I don't have enough letters for heave. Uh, I do have enough for ova. Um, it just seems a shame to play that when there's probably a better play somewhere. Oh, here we go. Is that a word? Graved. Hmm. Overage. Wow. Holy, or not overage, but overage. Although I think both are words. Oh no. Hmm. Or, yeah, unfortunately we're missing an E. That's the problem. So if people know if this is a word, we can try it. Else I'm open to suggestions. <laughs> Garderobs. I unfortunately don't even know what that means, but that sounds awesome. Um. Alright, so I'm going to try Graved because I don't see anything else. Oh, it happens to be a valid word. Fantastic. Alright, now I've got three letters remaining. D-A-T. That's a bit, that's a tad bit of trouble now, isn't it? Uh, there's gotta be a place to play it. Or maybe there isn't. Here we go. Data. Works perfectly. All right. Hooray! 349 points scored during the game. My rating got adjusted plus 23 because I was playing against a noob. Um, thank you for playing. Oh, thank you. Alright. Um, so now I think I can like summon... Yeah, let's get a game recap. Yep, yep, no, I understand what the premium tiles are, though that's good information. Um, Alright, so... Huh. That's actually quite sad that the game history window doesn't show uh, the location of each play. Or even just verbalize it here, like, 
uh, FIR starting at G8, I think. I thought this game had a game analysis mode afterward. Um, if not, that's pretty sad. I mean, yeah, I could save the game. Sure. Game one. Okay. But I think that just saves the current position of the game. Yeah. Well, that's too bad. I could have sworn I had some version of this game that would analyze your game and tell you how well you played it. Um, maybe this isn't that version. Um, okay, so, um, that's, oh, um, Now I think I should allow links, um, although beware that I'll have to stop the stream and start it back up. Um, what difficulty? Yeah, no, I have it set to beginner level difficulty. Um, so we're going to ramp it up just a little bit. So we're going to start a new game using the same account. And we're going to add a computer player. And this time, play against Intermediate. Um, so, oh, huh. I don't know how I ended up with a rating of 1581, but I'll take it. Um, you know, maybe, maybe we'll remove uh, that player and add an advanced player. I'm going to get my butt kicked so bad playing this, but let's see. Let's play. Game preferences. Here we go. Oh. Well, whatever. We're going to try it in tournament mode. Oh, it's on. Alright, I forget what tournament mode rules are, how much time you get and all that, but... Um, We're going to see just how this goes. Um, flip. Hopefully is not a bad starting play. Fib. Probably also not so bad. But given that the timer's ticking, I want to keep playing. Wedges. All right. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. All right. Um, I could spell petty. I don't know what else I'm going to spell, right? Uh, Betty is a proper noun. It's just a name. Uh, Yeti spends a blank. So I think this is a good way to go. I could do petty bet. Uh, it's totally not a word. All right, we got math. And down here, I assume A-Y is a word. I don't know. Ah, I start with 1,500. Okay. Well, that's very soon to change now, isn't it? Um, also, I don't think A-Y is a word. Um, so I've got a C and a Z and a B. Um. Cozy. Although that would put the Z on a triple word line, but I get double points on it, so it's not so bad. Cozy bait. Would be fantastic. Now it's close. Oh! Radiates. Okay. But we got some decent letters here, right? Is there some way we could use a triple triple over here? Because that'd be awesome. 
I have too many duplicated letters for it to, for that to be a real possibility. But it'd be awesome if that did happen. Submit, right? Yeah! Play. 30 points. So I'm only trailing by 20. Um, zeal is pretty obvious. 39. Caned. Alright, so. Now comes the hard part. What do I do? I've given myself a pretty awful rack with a lot of eyes here. And unless I have a word like radii, I don't know what to do. Um, oh, lazy would have been good, putting Z on the double letter score. Um, yeah, you're right. That would have been... Well, cozy's probably not terrible, but lazy would have been a good word. Um... I don't want to leave this R open for very long either. Um, yeah, no, I'm seriously confused. Hmm. Well, I've got to use some eyes somehow. Um, nail would use some vowels. Braille would use some vowels, but I don't want to use the A. I want to just get up rid of the eyes. Grin. Turn radiates into irradiates. Holy moly. Okay. <laughs> yeah. That's beautiful. Uh, that's beautiful. That's definitely the most beautiful play of the game. And I'll change that into fear radiates if I had an F, but I don't. No, it's not a word, but I'm just, I got confused because I saw an F and I thought I had an F. thought there was something silly I could say, and now I'm just completely crazy. Um, so I'm trailing by 45 points. Well, I'm doing pretty good compared to how I expected to do. So I see lion and loin. Um, yeah. But that doesn't score very much, whereas I could play like wow up here. Um, that's nine points. Really, I just need to um, not have so many I's and N's here. Um, okay. Yeah, wow is good. We'll go with wow. It's actually 10 points. Alright. Um. <laughs> so, alien, perhaps? Although I could almost play that anywhere. And it doesn't score very much on the bottom of the board. Um, gain. Starting with guns, I could play gain down here. If he had an S, though, he could get a triple, so it's not so bright. Um, Fain? F-A-I-N? I don't know. Keep trying to find words that have an I in them. Inane. Alright, anion. I don't have an O. Anion would have been good earlier. Inane. And it. Start from triple letter score at the bottom right. Uh, okay. Like here? Oh, triple letter score. That's right. Yeah, that makes sense. Perfect. Now we get some letters. Something we can do something with. Alright, here's our place. What's the word, guys? Bear? I want to use an I if I can, but... Um, 
啊。Unless there's like a, I mean, there's no placing down here, right? If I had an S, it would be rabies, um, but I don't. So. Bear seems okay. Uh, I'm not sure what else. Not there. Cross of guns and submits would have... Oh. Oh. Okay. Yeah, that would have been a better place to put inane. Um... Yeah, that looked bottom-ish, but yeah, you're right. Over here would have been the place, this triple letter score. Um, I guess that's on row 10, column, I don't know, M? N? One of those columns? I mean, the spot's still open. You could still use it for something. Especially as my opponent threatens to score in the upper left, I could try to build something over here. But inane would have been better here. Um, for so many reasons. Uh, now if I put a B, maybe I can build downward here. I was looking binary, but I don't have a Y. Um, don't have a T for banter. Um, yeah, I don't know. Brainer. Probably still use the space. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Brainer would be cool. B R A I N E R. If only there's an open end somewhere. Uh, <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I don't know. So I'm tempted to play back up here again. It's B-A-R-E, leaving me with three eyes. But other than that, it's okay. I'm a bit of a loss. Brind, bin. All right, brind? Oh, that doesn't fit here, but it's a good word. Um. Oh, bin, that's just a nice score. And it actually gets rid of the letters I want to get rid of, so... Yeah, that makes sense. 15 points. That's really good. Well, that's mean. Why would you close up the board right when we need to score points? Alright, so I'm thinking rake. Are there any objections to rake? Or any suggestions other than rake? Um... Looking down here, I don't see any six-letter words starting with an R. I don't see any words ending in, well, really anything here. Um, so I'm thinking rake. I'm going to put this down, and people let me know if this is okay.
Yep. All right, so rake sounds good to me, too. That's 30 points. Hello. <laughs> All right, so we can play an X here. Um, so, what else could I play? It's like the game is trying to throw this back to me if it plays that. I think just the letter X is the best I can do. Unless I can land the X on a triple some or a double somehow and score it twice. Actually, I could do that in the upper left corner. And if I had an F and an L, I could spell flax in the upper right. Hmm. Elixir. Hmm. Oh, wow, that is playable. Yeah, elixir would... Well, I don't know if N-I is a word. And... But yeah. If N-I is a word, then elixir is the way to go. And this is why it's important to know your twos and threes, is so you can play words that other people can't play. We feeling good about this, are we? Hmm. I think it needs to be tried. Otherwise, I'm just hosed. Oh, this scores 27. If I just put an X in the corner, that scores 30 all by itself. I'm putting an X here and doing like app or X, like EX, scores me 40. So as good as this looks, it looks beautiful, but I don't think it's the highest scoring play. And I think it does get rid of an eye. Well, it gets rid of two eyes. Hmm. Yeah, I guess that's the advantage of it. That future players, future plays may be doable, even though this doesn't isn't the highest scoring play on the board. Okay, yeah, I don't think NI is a word either. And plus, I'm not so sure that I want to play that. Probably is best, but... Um, I'm thinking EX right there. 38 points. Because the X gets counted four times. Um, I'm going to try it. You've got to be kidding. What? I don't understand this play. really daring because it gives me a double and a triple and if I had the right letters it would be over um. That's not good. Now I could use an A. I really could use an A right about now. Uh, I can't exchange either. The bag is empty. I'm so screwed. <laughs> Great. Hmm. Well, I could probably concede at this point. I tried so hard and it got so far, but in the end, it didn't matter. Orion. Hmm. Oh, Orion would have been good. Yeah. Um.
This is sad. This is... This does not fill you with joie de vivre. How you, however you say that. Yeah, it's not a word, but you get the idea. Um, I do not know French. Ooh, ooh, it's got to be a word, right? I wish. That'd be so fantastic. EQ. EQ, starting from, next to R. Sure, we'll give it a go. Oh, that's a word? Ah, it's not a word. It would've been good if it were. Yeah, sadly that did not work. But we're gonna lose this anyhow. What are you? No, well, uh, my book has that word. My book totally has that word. It's not fair that the computer gets to just take my words off the board. <laughs> but at least I have some fun trying them, right? Um. I did not misplay on purpose. My word knowledge is just that different from what the computer's word knowledge is. And if that gives you some idea of like what computer I'm playing, that's kind of interesting, but... Um. Hmm. Maven passed. Ooh, Maven's out of place. IQ is a word. All right. Um, Unfortunately, this version of Scrabble doesn't think that IQ is a word. So I'm just going to play a few words to end the game. Oh, that's right. NI is not a word. We learned that earlier. Um, okay. What else? How do I finish this up? I think I'm going to be stuck with the Q, which is why I've just been playing quickly. Um, I don't see anywhere to put the Q. Oh, I'm sorry. Q-I-N. Okay. Well, sorry I messed that up. Alright, so I've lost the game. That could have been close if I saw QIN somewhere. I missed it. I got a little pessimistic about uh, my winning chances. Um, so with that, I'm going to go back to playing the mini games because those are easier.
mini games. Oh yeah. Let's pick suffixes. Oh. Well, how about that? Find all the words that use that suffix. Hmm. Well, that's all I know. Um, hmm. K-E-D can't be the most common suffix ever. Oh, height. That's right. Miked, hiked, hooked. Gooked. I doubt that gooked is a word. Maybe it is. Okay, what else could it be? Yeah, following the stream, I'll have to see if I can look through um, my other software and see if I've got some newer version of this game. Preferably one that allows me to analyze games afterward and suggest what I should have played. Because I thought I had something like that. Mooked. Alright, we're going to give a Mooked a play. Mooked is not a word. Choked is a word, but we don't have a C. What else could there be? Oh, also the chat window must be overlapping this. Um, didn't even think about that until just now, but uh, that can't look too beautiful. <laughs> yeah, when a mook roughs you up, you've been mooked, man. Uh, I wish you... Actually, you can add words to the dictionary. Um... And sometime I'll have to exploit that, because uh, it could be hilarious. But in the meantime, we're going to leave it be. How about ooked? Ook. You've been ooked. All right, yeah, I have no idea. Hoped. To give false value to. Okay, we're going to try this again. Six, the end in TCH. Well, I know Fletch. Yeah, I know Fletcher. Um, that doesn't end in TCH. Um, I know Fetch. I know Wretch with a W. Okay, we're going to do it without a W. Yeah, that's right. Uh, what else could it be? What else is valid, guys? Itch. But I don't have an I, and it doesn't... Well, I don't even know if it matters how many letters are in the word. Etch. Right. Yeah, what do you suppose the other two are? Uh... Hmm. 
a tat -a attached that sort of thing. Except that's not at all how you spell it. Uh, and I don't have any A's, but attach, when you like abbreviate it and hide an A in there, would end in T-C-H. Letch. All right, we're gonna try that. I think that's a word. Okay. What else could be played? Catch. Um, yeah, I don't know, man. Does anybody know? I think I'm probably just going to give up again. And try probably an easier minigame. Um, yep, that's what I'm doing. Rotch. See... I didn't think that was a word, just why I didn't play it, but it is a word. Uh, so let's pick an easier game. Review games. Oh, this is perfect. Fur was played. Can I find a play at 8D across? Furring. Huh. Okay, that's pretty cool. How should I evaluate moves here? Um, ver various combinations of tiles are worth certain amounts of points, apparently. Um, wait, if I back up to the start, furring. I assume that furring, F-I-R, with the letters, yeah, furring could have been played. Uh, or whatever else you were suggesting was probably also playable. Toyer. Could I find a good place to play every? Well, how about right here, right? Um, although, that's probably assuming that... Yeah, no, it should have just played every straight down on the R. Okay. Frontage. It's a nice play. <laughs> Could I... Can I find a good place to play Negator? Or Negator? I am so confused. Why would I play that? Negator J8. Uh, I'm gonna say that that's like somewhere around here. <laughs> each! You gotta beat my mosquito when it eaches! Yeah. Yeah, the computer's gonna point out all my mistakes. Uh, still, negator. Um, if I place to play negator, negator J eight for seventy points. Um, A B C D E F G H I J eight. It's like here. Unless it means down here. Maybe it does. J8 or 8J is somewhere around this area. Um, here are the plays to consider, given the hand that I had. Frontage was definitely playable. Also player was Negator, Tetragon, Nitrogen, Frontage, and several words that aren't awesome. Oh! So Negator was the highest scoring play. I must have used all the letters, although I still don't see where you would have played it. Um, unless you're saying Toyer followed by an E is playable, then, then yeah, Negator across would be fantastic. Uh, oh, wait, it must mean down here. It must mean this way, Negator. Um... That would have been a bingo that goes through a triple letter score. Or Fern? Okay, yeah, J8. Fern. Are you sure about this? 
Can it just say J8? And that is J8. So that must be a word. Fern. I thought Fern had an E. Apparently it also has an I. Um, okay, Negator and Tetragon are the same except for score, so Negator must be better. Uh, and yeah, my Negator and the computer suggested Negator. Um, comparing those, this Negator is better because it scores more. Okay, that makes sense. Laud. Can I think of a better place to play Laud? Who can't? <laughs> That's the real question. I mean, okay, my opponent had an A in their hand, and, like, this is... Why would you play there? It makes no sense whatsoever. There must be a better place to play it. With this open of a board and so many p possibilities, like... I don't know, play it there. L-A-U-D. The L on the triple. Um, Laud on H2. Uh, H2. Oh, our, okay, so our rank's from the bottom going up? I don't know. Why does it say H2, I2? I'm so confused. Unless it's saying that H2 is, like, somewhere out here. L-A-U-D. Yeah, that would score something. Yeah, that's not bad at all. I was thinking down here, L-A-U-D. Although maybe D-A is not a word. Or maybe there's a reason to play it up there instead. Um, how do you evaluate moves? What moves follow the priorities? <laughs> oh, crap. Here are the plays to consider. Duality. Duality. Unduly. Yeah, this is fantastic, I just gotta say. Oh, Fern. Crystalline or uh, granular snow. Particularly at the upper pond of a glacier, which has not been compressed into ice. Uh, this is pretty fantastic. So duality is a pretty damn good word. Um, wait. 12b, 30 points. Yeah, okay, okay. Yeah, suffice it to say, computer could have played a lot better there. Feast was good. Can I find a play at 1E across? Alright, so I guess if 1 must refer... If this is 1E across, 1E um, either refers to the first most column or the topmost rank. And if it's the topmost rank, that doesn't make any sense. Um, so 1E across must be... Um, Column 1, rank E? I don't know. Fine. Starting at 1E. Or is that 11E? Damn screen resolution is just special. Um, okay, we can play... Yeah. <laughs> we'll play another game following this. Um, I'm going to evaluate moves here. Feast scores a lot, which follows all the priorities. Safe, fine, fiat, safe, fame, all this. Didn't really come up with feast because, um, well, the S is plus 8 points, just in general. II in the hand is minus 10. S in the hand is plus 8. So, yeah. This um, this leaves me um, with a leave that's not very excellent. Um, fine doesn't surpass Seif because the the the. Okay, that's cool. Whatever. Pi with uh, A C O Y in the hand. Can I find a play at three across? Or three D across. Um. 3D across, I don't know, Paco or something? Yeah, let's see. Copy. Oh, of course. Copy would have been excellent. Um, Alright, so let's get through the rest of this. Alright, did it like no? 
And I find a play at a4 down. Um, a4. I don't know. Unknown. Woken. That would have been brilliant. Yeah, Woken would have been excellent. Here's the words to consider. Woken, winked, miked, no, women, oinked. Okay, well, let's not brood on that too much. Um, yeah, we're going to pick not an advanced player. We're going to go back and play intermediate. So, now we're hovering at a 631 rating instead of 1631. My best play's been uh, 39 point. That doesn't make sense. I've played at least a bingo. What does it mean, best play? Heck if I know. Maybe that was just my last game. What was my best play? <gasps> if so, then that's cool. Uh, again, we're hovering in tournament mode. Um, here we go. Alright, I don't have enough points for Moxie. Um, I don't have enough letters for Moxie is what I meant to say. Um, Ox seems okay. So we're looking at Ox right now. 18 points. What else? What else could it be? No, Ox can't be bad. If I knew more words, I could play more words, but we're going to play Ox. Pickaxe. Okay. Just have to remind myself my opponent is not a genius and is not going to play the best move every move, even though that one looked pretty damn impressive. Um, so, what am I looking at here? Poor. Um, I don't know. More. Room. Roomy. Pickaxey. Pickaxey and Roomy. Wouldn't that be fantastic? Uh, oxy. If oxy is a word, I don't know that it is. Um, yoke. Get the triple letter score. There we go. Beer must be working. It's very good. Weenie. Holy moly. Uh, okay. Yeah, if you're telling me that that's good, I guess. Weenier. <laughs> I don't even know, but I assume that refers to a hot dog, and so weenier is probably no good, which is why I, I suggest it in jest. Um, don't have an L for yokel. I don't even know if that's a word. Uh, grove. There's nowhere to place grove. Um, uh, so you got a V and an M and a couple O's. Vroom. How about vroom? Any objections to vroom? Other than we have no idea if that's actually a word, and room is good, and room probably isn't. But what else am I going to do, right? <laughs> no. Um, now, what can I do, though? I'm probably not going to submit that unless I get that thumbs up on that, and I don't think I'm going to get any approval on that. Groom is a word. Groom is much better. Now, is that we want to play? It's definitely a word. I like it. Uh, I don't mean to rush you, though, if you want to play something else. Um, Groom looks good. I'm trying to go through various other possibilities, but 
uh, looks really good. It's hard to imagine that something better is going to appear with the uh, tiles locked in this weird manner. Um, and by locked, I just mean like there's a rank of letters and then pretty much empty and another rank of letters and then pretty much empty and another rank. So placing words is getting tricky at this point. Okay. Well, I'm going to assume that this is what we want to play. I'm just looking. Going once. Going twice. Okay, there it is. 20 points. Hurt. Now, is there anywhere I could place my V to good effect? Like Van here? Or VI something? Vile? I don't think RA is a word. Or OL is definitely not a word. Uh, via would. Yeah, I don't know. But Van is good. I know Van is good. There's no reason for me to jeopardize Van. Now, Van would kind of lock up this area of the board, and I think in the spirit of trying to open the board, Ova would be a better play. Um, just because these are spaced far enough apart that words could be placed on either side. Uh, I don't have the letters for ovation, but it'd be cool if I had that. Oval's good. Mono might be better. Oh, Via. Okay, yeah, we're going to play Via then. Do you mean Via here? Or do you mean it somewhere else? I see it in the upper right, and I see it here. And here it scores uh, 16 points. Yeah, it's altogether possible there might be a better word. Like malt. Um, malt could be played like toward the upper right. You could play it uh, somewhere up here. Uh, huh. Okay, you say yes there. I'm assuming you're talking about the uh, right here, so um, probably not about malt. And I play because I have six minutes. Oh, well, that's unfortunate. Arr! Well, that's a shame. Um, the via here would be good. Can I combine it with the N? Uh, yeah, like, is there a word I can use the N with? Or van, I mean, I know van is good. Vio is probably good. Malt is good. Um, I'm not sure what else to try. Yokel is a word. Can I combine yokel with the N? Oh. Okay. Yeah, so if I had van something L, would be cool. How many points does Yokel score, anyhow? 14 points, so that's not something to pass up on. Um, uh, although if I play van, I, well, no. I don't know many words that end or start with an L and use the rest of these letters. That's the issue. Like if lav were good, I would probably play lav. Although, I mean, there's some risk there, but I think it's worth the risk. Ah. Uh. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Uh, that doesn't even score that many. Okay. Uses up both of my A's. It's it's a sad move. Plus, I'm trying to keep this family friendly. Maybe okay, we're doing Van. We still have the option to play the L here. Um, probably want to play the L here now. Um. So, what can I do? And I don't know any words like Avin. So that's, I don't think that works at all. So I have to play 
down here or somewhere else. Uh, this has got to work better now that I have decent-ish letters. Um, I almost have enough for militia. Almost. I have enough for alarm. Yeah, it's good fun to do it on a Scrabble board. That's that's for sure. Yeah. Uh, there's liar. It's twenty points. Liar mat. The mat that you lie on. Lair. Um. Hmm. Putting an A across here is dangerous, but fun. So I'm going to go with that. Lair is probably the smart play. Putting the A here is the fun thing to do. Alright, so here we have an excellent opportunity to put an A in pretty much anything else. Um, unless we know, like, M something might want to work too. I don't know what else could be put before an E. Like, I don't think F-E works. I know E-F is good, but that's not the question here. Um, MAD is okay. Uh, MAG is probably okay. Uh, oh no! Uh, I'm... Uh, I blame Twitch. Twitch has too much delay. But where would I even place Marshall? Or... Or marital. Uh, I feel awful for not having played that. Alright, so, what do I play now? Um, yeah, I think I have to go with something in the upper corner here. Um, and I have to keep moving uh, because of the timer. Or it's going to deduct points at the end of the game. I think Matt's not bad. Uh, the mag would be better if it works. But I don't think mag's acceptable. Uh, so I'm gonna play mad. I think. Yeah, this is fine. And this opens up the. Okay, dent. My opponent plays. Again, I don't have enough vowels to play across here. Um, this is not good. I've got myself in a position where I have no vowels. Despite spending two consonants and one vowel last turn. Um, so what do I try here? How do I play this? Here's a place for a letter. I think that's about the best I can do without a vowel. And it's 26 points, so it's not bad. Yeah. It's not getting any better than that. Buys. Okay. Well, we're going to play the obvious. Although, perhaps, yeah, we're actually going to play bit. Doesn't score as many points, but having this many T's on um, uh, rack is rather disturbing. Arc. All right, so. Surprisingly, I'm still 40 points ahead. Um, somewhere I can play here. I mean, there's cups or cup. Um, Furl is not there. Pie. There we go. I mean, there's no need for me to even play anything else because this scores me 10 points. And now I have another vowel. <laughs> Maybe it exchanged four tiles. I don't blame it. Um, carts. 
carts is a word. Uh, cart is a word. Kurt. Kurt is a word. Um, I could use the T and the G and the U. I could. Well, I guess tug uses all of those, but there's nowhere to put it. But I'm just trying to balance this out. Although there's no place on the board to even put a bingo if I had one. Um, See, so yeah, bingo is just not happening today. Uh, carts is pretty okay. Liars is good. Yokels is good. Um, putts, Kurtz, Stewart. All right. Yeah, putts, Kurtz, Stewart. Well, there's Kurtz. Um, start from liars. It becomes liars. Okay. Uh, we're going to give it a go. Here we go. 17 points. And... Not a Bummer. Oh well. Damn computer keeps cheating and taking my letters away. Uh... Damn, damn computer. You don't see me taking its letters away. Yeah. Alright, yeah, sub it is. That did occur to me also. I didn't say it aloud because I was looking for something else, but I didn't see anything. Um... Okay, we got an E and all this open space here. Uh, it's like the computer's trying to set us up. Uh, I got tart. Great. Uh, the other great. Uh, gear. I suppose that's about it. Um, so probably great here is probably best. Oh, that doesn't fit. Um, target. Okay, T A R. Targetan <laughs> and target. Yeah, this is good. And surprisingly, the computer did not make use of the triple word score. Um, so we kind of have an obligation to do so. Although probably this triple word score is better. We've got idea. But hang on, we've got four vowels, a blank, and two consonants. And nowhere on the board to play a, um, a bingo. Well, maybe there's one over here. Um, if anybody knows an eight letter word starting with a T that uses a U in bingos, that would be. The sort of thing we'd be looking for here. Unless epi is a word, and then maybe we can bingo on the first column. But this balance of letters makes me think there's not a bingo. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure there isn't one. Um, like, the mo closest I can think of, the best suffix I can think of is idu, like residue. But I don't have uh, letters to bingo on that. Um, so, yeah, thinking back to my original plan, um, probably use the triple in the center right. So 
so we'll probably place something here. Uh, but what? Probably Dane. D A N E. It's probably good. Uh, Dune would also be good, except T-U is not a word. Dine is actually better, because it gets rid of the I. Yeah, why don't I get rid of the I? Any last-minute adjustments to this, or this is going to be good? Yep, here we go. Dine it is. 27 points. Are you kidding me? Didn't like A-I-R-E. Fine. Uh, I've seen that word used, but I guess it just doesn't like it. Um, so, din. Targeted. Alright. Untargeted. No, okay, just kidding. Uh, I've got, like, word letters for sausage. S-A-U-S-A-G-E. Sausaged. That's good, right? Do we have an opinion on this one? Or, actually, do we have an opinion on Epi? So let's see, starting here, up. I can't navigate with the arrow keys. Could also play Assuage. Right? A S S U A G E. Oh, Assuaged. Assuaged is definitely a word. I don't know if Epi's a word. Uh, but I know it's swaged. Plus it also gives you the excuse to do this, right? Am I right? Okay. Uh, target is, is a word. Just get something down there for the triple. Okay. Um, but this scores me more than a triple. So we're going to go with this. Um, fuse. Here we go. Unless there's better. And maybe there is. Maybe I just play across the bottom instead. But fuse looks awesome. Uh, foe. I don't know. I've got a lot of vowels. And this uses up a U. And the F. And a double. So I'm playing it. Fez. Ooh, that's good. Um, Alright, we're going to go with Epi here and try something fun over here. Uh, Duh. Um, yeah, well, that looks fine. If it works, it leaves me with good letters for next turn. Epi is no good. It must stand for something. Um, so get a second chance to play Dove somewhere else. Oh, pardon me. Um, well, Dover is not a word, but Lover is. Dovel was one letter better. Uh, yes. Yeah, Dovel would be pretty cool. Do not argue. Can't argue with that logic. Uh, do I have better than just Lover there? Like, how about Glover, the video game character? Okay, I'm just gonna play something, because I'm way leading this game. And I need to ensure that I don't lose on time or something stupid. Um, so, where do I put my J-A? It's going to go somewhere. I can't go there because AP's not a word. Uh, we're going to tap that. Oh, but then that you, you could use up the spot and I might not get to play it. I can't be so opportunistic here. J-O is a word. Uh, yeah. I don't know enough twos and threes to get away with a lot of 
shenanigans here. So I'm just going to play the obvious and just make sure I use my letters up. Uh, GG. Thank you for playing. I beat the intermediate player. This game needs more intermediate levels. Can I just say that? This would be fantastic if I could just hack the game and put in my own custom AI for it. Um, so we're going to save game. Uh, game 2. Dot save. Alright, let's go back. Main menu. Mini games. Okay. Review game. Yeah. Flip is okay. Can I find a play? I don't know. Fitly. Okay, well, fitly makes sense. Wedges. Do I see a play at 7C across? Wage. I don't know, I think wedges is pretty awesome. Okay, yeah, you're using up the S, so you are getting plus 0.5. It's better than average move, but not by much. Um, Petty is a nice play. <laughs> Can I find a place to play Yeti? I did not see any such place, but I guess down here? Okay. 4i. 4i must be here? Oh, Y-E-T-T. Okay, 4i means starting on row 4, just play across, starting at i. So here, y-e-t-t -T would have been interesting. Yeah, if you can cheat and play down words that aren't don't make any sense, go for it. Um, okay, well that's cool. Oh, that's right, yeah, I could set it, I set a skill level. Um, alright, let's, let's do that. Um... But before I do that, I want to. I'm so curious. I need to know what this remaining option is. This Professor Maven. You're playing the last two games. This is about 567 caliber. Click next for a detailed error analysis. So I don't get what's up with the two rating systems, but okay, fine. Uh, vowel dumps. 106 points lost on three errors out of four opportunities. Two letter words, 70 points lost. Three letter words, 216 points lost on eight opportunities. Okay, just give me something. The easiest errors to correct are in the two letter word category. Yeah, okay, so it's just telling me this is the thing I should play if I want to improve. But screw that. Let's keep playing. You don't need to improve. We're not bad. We're just not good. All right, so 1,400? Yeah, let's get 1,400 to try. Play. All right. Vocal. I don't have the letters for convex. I do have vex. Um, I have coax. What else? Yeah, I mean, it's entirely possible that two ratings are actually the same rating system and I'm just suck. Let's not forget that possibility. Uh, but yeah, I'm thinking Coax. C-O-A-X. Uh, so, like here? No, 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 no. The plus side of playing it there is that they don't play a triple on the X. Um... Maybe there's a better place to play that. <laughs> uh, no, we could try that. That makes sense. It would leave me with an A. I kind of like that. I think that's a good word. Yeah. Like a coxswain, somebody who um, navigates a boat. All right, tell me that there's not a way to use the X. Like I could spell A X E and build across from the E. I could spell lax. Um, 
I don't know any words that just end in K. I don't even think that OK is a word. Um, but maybe it is. But if it is, then I don't know. It doesn't even score that much, and I don't know if it's any good. Um, let's see, let me shuffle this. Veal. Veal is a word. <laughs> Vax is a word, in a sense, or it's probably a name. Um, uh, axles, soak, oak, okay, yeah, axles is a word, soak and oak are both good, probably want to play oak, because I'm the only one holding an S, or so I hope, um, oaken, but uh, I don't have letters for it, um, axle looks tempting, actually. Although it uses good letters, so let's get rid of letters I don't like. <laughs> Melons. Levy? I'm thinking Levy. But there's probably something better. Um, I'm not seeing anything better, though. Evolve? I don't have two V's. Oh, that also uses up all of my E's. Uh, better than Levy would be Level. This would leave me with a bo more balanced hand at the end. Yeah. We're playing Level. Making an executive... Of course! There's no way I could have known that it would have given me two E's, um, but I, I insisted that that would have been more balanced. To, okay, whatever. There's no way I could have expected that. Esteem? Um, what else? G, G, E, E. Um, Uh, yeah, we could spell G here. Well, G is a two-point letter, so putting it on a triple doesn't score much. Uh, I really can't score much with this at all. Oh, but we still have this option. Still could put an S here. Uh... Is geeses a word? It doesn't even score much if it is. Um, hang on. Mouse, don't give up on me, mouse. Come on. My mouse is... There it is. Here's my cursor. Although, if I can play that, why can't I play, like, all of my letters? Well, because I have three E's. It's probably why not. Um, oh, I need to get like Nightbot or something that does anagrams. Wouldn't that be fantastic? Um, egret. E g r e t s. Yeah, I, I'm not seeing any way to use all seven. So there we go. Igneous. Uh, rotary? Gert? If I remember right, we saw this in the game past, and it's playable. And leaves me with letters that can be used for stuff. So here we go. Alpine. 
Okay. Way to set me up, buddy. It always knows when I need help. Um, but no, I can't even use that. I wish I could. But that's not usable. Um, why don't I go back up to the top here? Like this. I could pare this down. P-A-R-E. Uh, I don't know what else. I'm sure there's all kinds of words in this position, and I'm seeing only a very small fraction of them. Um, rave. Uh, somewhere else I could spell brave, but uh, what's the point? This is actually getting rid of letter. Oh, I could pave. Pave is better if I spell it P A V E. I could even turn it into paver, but why would I do that? R is a good letter. Um, yeah, pave is better. Glad we see we agree here. Good timing. Band. Well, we got a Z. Uh, that's about all the good news we have in this position. Um, I was kind of afraid this might catch up to us because a lot of vowels got played early. Um, but, you know, stuff happens. Um, Well, I know in a newer edition of the Scrabble Dictionary, ZA was introduced as a word. I don't think this game knows about that word. And it's not like this game takes updates or anything, so... I'm gonna stay away from that, unless I have nothing else I can play. Um, biz, B-I-Z, probably not in this dictionary. Um, easy, branch from level. Okay. Yep. Uh, like here, right? We're, I'm totally up for trying this. Here we go. Yeah, I was concerned that that might not work, but I didn't see anything better, so I just went with it. Easy, unfortunately, does not have a Z. I still don't see anything good. BRR is a word. It's a good fun word. Uh, but where would I put it? I could spell zap. Uh, or I could save my Z for next turn. As long as these places don't both get used up, the Z's going to go if I get good letters. So. Let me focus on getting rid of, or playing good letters here. Um, geeser. <laughs> Bar and geeser. Not a word. Uh, I think burr with a U is actually a word. Uh, that's dangerous. Okay. And now we play rays. Um, a razor, as in one who raises. Uh, unless there's a better score. Like I could play zap, as I was originally suggesting. So leave me with the e and the r. Um, it's definitely worth considering. Uh, wait. Oh, that's a blank. Uh huh. Huh huh huh. Okay. 
Zany. Zany. That's pretty zany. Oh, here? Yeah, that works. That leaves me with consonants. Uh, or so it leaves me with the R and the E, which is good. Yeah, I like it. Unless you're suggesting somewhere else, in which case I still like it, wherever it is that you're suggesting it. But looking all over the board, that seems to be the only place to place it. Um, that gets the triple, so that's what it's going to be. Just. Ooh. Okay. Rewire, right? Um, that's what my initial thought is. Um, what else? What, what could be played? Wirer? As in one who wires? Um... Play rewire across the top row. Uh, I would use up an R and leave me with just an M. So I'm thinking down here is probably best. Oh, wait, that leaves me with the M and an R. In which case, I probably uh, do want to use everything. And this would leave me with just an M, which is something that. Maybe I can bingo with later. Are you kidding? Oh, I was going to say, are you challenging that? Because I'm pretty sure it's a word. Okay. Um, now we can play something on the bottom. Um, why are we starting from the double letter score? Uh... Oh yeah, that would have scored twice as many on the W itself. Um, w I R, it would have left me with R M instead of this, which maybe would have been better. Uh, I can't tell. Fortunately, this place is still here. If we can think of another word. Um, there's no word, not that uses that. Uh, <laughs> so what else? What can there be? I also keep looking at this AH spot and there's like nothing. Um, there's whoa down here. Mop. Mop isn't bad. There's definitely better words that I've seen than mop, but it's not terrible. Okay, so I'm going to play something. Probably mop. And have some more time to think next turn, and, and I don't like that leave, though. That leave leaves some things to be desired. Uh, row. There's a leave that I can deal with. Worm. Wop. Okay, worm. I like it. Uh, wop is playable. Yeah, I actually like wop better. Probably scores more, too. Um... But having the M could be quite useful. Oh, are you kidding me? Orient. How about Worient? Alright, so. Shame on me. Um, I think this is probably a point where a player would concede if they... For seriously considering conceding, 
but in tournament games you don't concede, so play it out. Um, so I guess I'm going to go with Woe. Iodine. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's not very many human players who would find Iodide. Um, yeah, there are some, but most players would not do that. And those who did find Iodide would not play it. <laughs> um... Okay, how is there not a word here? Yeah, I don't understand. Alright, well, this sucks. <laughs> um, Tom? Tom seems playable. Let's play it. 32 points. Fan. Can extend this into Fang. I don't see anything better. Just gonna play it. Still trailing by 50, so there's not much point in fighting too hard. <laughs> it's not like... I don't know if it affects my rating or not, but... Um, yep. So Suit is playable, and I'm out. Um, make one last effort to see if there's anything else here. Nah, I don't see anything else. Unit? Unit's playable. Suit's playable. Unit's playable. Um, we're just going to pick one. We're going to play Unit. Alright. Adjusted rating. So I'm confused. Oh. Winner, Maven. Rating adjusted minus 11, and my rating went up 11. It's not what I expected from losing that game, but I don't remember how that worked. Oh, C2 is a word. That's cool. So, I guess ratings somehow must consider what's your actual score. It certainly doesn't consider the time that it took you to play the game, because I spent uh, 18 more minutes than my opponent did. To the nearest, or rounding to a minute. Um, so, uh, I'm going to switch this back into puzzle mode because my head's starting to spin from playing this. Um, oh, let me save the game. Save game. Game three. You can always analyze the game later. Actually, that's probably. Let me start a mini game while I go get a beverage. Um, we're gonna play prefixes, anagrams, no prefixes. Oh, what's what's on the here? We'll click bingo. Here, find a bingo. I'm getting a beverage. Have you found it yet? No, I'm just kidding. Nobody's that good. At least nobody who watches Twitch is that good. Also, what's this the... What's this one up here? Euromaic? Does that have to do with urea? Or uramic. I've never heard that word. <laughs> also, feezes. F-E-E-Z-E-S. 
Spinecket. Okay. Um, sure. Sounds good to me. Spin Eket. Oh. Not there. Pinkest. There we go. There's a word that you and I can relate to. Hundred eight points. Perfect. Halorian. Ravelins. Voden. Hmm. But what do we have here? Gazitas. How about Gazitas? Oh, spine kit. Okay. A tool kit or tool set for manipulating your spine. Yeah, spine kit. Gazitas, a big fat hairy ape with no temper. Um, any other suggestions? I did like gazitas, which, I mean, there's no way it's a word, but it'd be hilarious if it were. Um, zags. Should I get a hint? Would a hint help us? Grazes? Uh, G R A Z E S leaves us with T A. At grazes. Uh, I'm getting a hint. I hope that's okay. Wait, where's the hint button? Oh, the hint button's disabled. Why would you? Okay, I can understand why, but. Can you at least tell us the number of letters in the correct word? Because that would be a hint. That would be subtle. And in most cases, it would say seven or eight. And hopefully, it would never quiz you on a nine or a ten, but. Hmm. Probably ends with E A S. Like this. Okay. Or with maybe with gazes. Although I don't know what you would start with. <laughs> oh dear. Or with EST perhaps. Although that doesn't leave you much variety in the start of the word. Hmm. Gazettes is so close. Yeah. G A Z. Oh, yeah, we're missing. <laughs> if we could just turn the A into a blank, we would be so totally set. Gazetta. Um, yeah, no, I don't know. I'm totally up with, uh, totally on board with giving up, but, um, if you want to keep playing this out, we'll play it out, I guess. Um, stag? I don't know. Gaztees. That's a word, because I want it to be. <laughs> well, 
well, no, I want it to be a word, therefore it's a word. We start using it in frequent conversation. We can make it a word. How are your GASDs doing today? Well, I see grazes, but I don't see anything better. This is a maximum score of 72, so it doesn't go, it probably doesn't go through the triple. Um, yeah. All right, we're giving up here. Give up. Oh, crud. Of course you would skip over the... the ah. Watch the Twitch replay to catch what just happened there. It's not good. It, yeah, we're never going to know. Um, we're going to try this again, because I'm ticked about that. All right, deer plus all, Adderall. It's not how you spell it at all. Drawl, drawled. Um, where would I put drawled? Yeah, here we go. Drawler. I somehow thought we had two D's. No, we have two R's, and I don't think drawler is a word. Um, Redrawl. <laughs> yeah, I just can't ask about some of these gazitas like that. It's so rude. Um, drawler. I don't know. I'm so confused. How could there be a word here? Drawlers. Oh. Yep, that works. Okay, thanks for helping me figure that out. Storage with an extra A. A sortage. <laughs> um, a storage. A wanting. Oh, that is a word, and I do know it. Uh, coast edge. How is there not like a word that goes down here, like coast edge? Or is that it? it? Seems too good to be true. Oh, coast edge, seventy-seven. Use the S from splinters. I'm not sure what you're referring to. Oh, never mind. You're just a little behind on the Twitch delay. Aww, I scored zero points for postage. So sad. Define last. Drawlers. Yeah, but the, 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 you can't. Fine, but. You're not going to tell me what I missed last turn? That's so cold. Um, yeah, I have no idea on this one. 
Yeah, damn it, Maven. <sighs> Knowing everything. Here, here's the word. Booze. 13 points. Okay. Um... Ain't no telling me that that's the wrong word. Uh, but seriously, I see nothing here. Unhit. Unite. Hutting. Sure. Yeah, hutting sounds fine. Uh, presumably from here, one, two, three, 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 this up here. I assume this is what you're talking about. I don't see anywhere else to put it. it does score 74 points, and the maximum score is 74, so... Play it. Ah. Oh. Okay, I goofed. Yeah, but the, can you not tell me what the... Uh, come on. That's not cool. We'll never know. But it probably was hunting. Or true thing or something. Who knows. Um, so, yeah, I hate to break this here, but I've been going for a while. My head's starting to spin from all the anagramming and such. Um, we'll review the last game I played, and from there, um, uh, I'll call it a stream. Oh, I thought I saved three games. I just, like, forget that I played, like, three games. But, yeah, we were, already went over this one. So, yeah, never mind. Um, let's start a network game. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. You can play this over the internet, guys. Let's join a multiplayer game. Uh, let's join an host IP address. 8888. 8888888888. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we're not going to find anybody anyway, but if somebody did have this game, we could play this over the internet. Uh, but yeah, uh, thanks for coming by, and I uh, hope to see you around next time. Thanks for watching.